Hi, this is Karen Buchholt with That'sVegetarian.com. Today I'm going to show you how to make a chickpea and red kidney bean salad. So now we're going to show you how to make your chickpea and red kidney bean salad. Two of the main ingredients would be chickpeas and red kidney beans. We also have some green beans, so it's almost like a three bean salad. We're going to chop up some uh, parsley and we also have some green onions and some garlic and then we are going to make our dressing and add it to it. So we'll start by adding the majority of our ingredients. And using fresh whenever possible is always best, but sometimes it's not possible to get the fresh green beans because they're not in season or you didn't have time to take the dry beans and soak them and cook them so you can also use canned. There are different ways in which you can chop for the parsley. I'm showing you how to use the kitchen shears, which makes it nice and easy. We're going to have some, make an Italian dressing of sorts. We have some parsley, which we're going to also finely chop, but I'm going to do this a little bit differently. I'm going to do this on the cutting board. And always bend your fingers back so you don't have to worry about cutting off your fingertips. And just do very thin shreds. So we'll add that to our little dressing shaker. Um, you can, once again, with the herbs, you always want to go fresh when you can, but if not, you can always go with some dry. I'm going to put in some oregano, probably about a tablespoon or a teaspoon, some dried oregano. Using crushed garlic instead of chopped garlic since it is in the dressing. We're going to shake things up a little bit and use some cider vinegar. You can always add more vinegar to taste, but you can't take it away. We're going to use some salt y pimienta avocado oil, about a tablespoon, a little bit of salt. Put in a little bit of yellow mustard. Now you'll want to put it in the container, in the top, so you don't get too much in. That would have been a little bit too much dry mustard. That's a little bit better, so now you put that in. Get the cap later, and some fresh ground pepper. With the amount of basil I put in there, I'm going to add a little bit more. You can see the amount of basil, so I'm going to add a little bit more avocado oil and a little bit more vinegar. Put the cap on tight so it doesn't wind up all over your kitchen. Okay, and we're going to shake it up. You want to shake it a little bit longer so you make sure that the garlic really gets mixed in there. I can't even tell you how wonderful and fresh it smells as well. The avocado oil just adds a little bit of different flavor than the olive oil. But by all means, you can use olive oil in your dressing as well. Okay, let's give a toss to our salad. And you'll want to chill the salad for at least an hour before you serve it. And you have your three bean salad, also known as a chickpea and red kidney bean. Once again, this is Karen with That's Vegetarian, and now you know how to make a chickpea and red kidney bean salad.